Hello everybody. This video is manifesto of my new channel. I would like to give you a few words about myself. I'm a Canadian composer, pianist, uh, musician, jazz player for more than four decades. So I had a chance uh, to try this and that. Uh, I've been composing music in symphonic genre, in, in, in jazz, in, recently in, in electronica. I even have a uh, trademark in Canada for the new genre, which is called jazzonica. It is a mixture of uh, jazz, mostly in harmonies, and uh, rather popular hip-hop or, or even disco. Altogether, this gives a, a particular chance for people to listen to something more complex than just mts, mts. and it's quite a fun for, for the creator for, for the composer i have composed more than a few uh, scores for short films some of them were published some of them well they didn't pass <laughs> The objective of this uh, of my channel is to present to you in short time spans my my music going two decades back through all this time that I passed writing it till today to most recent publications, most recent compositions. Each of those new presentations will be preceded by a short comment from me, a short story, because for every music I wrote, there is a story, there's something hidden behind that. I actually, uh, I tried to compose music just putting notes on staves and uh, believe me, that is that was not worth listening. The scores I find worth listening to will be explained or given some story which is behind and then of course there will be music with some small video or even just still image I'll try to make those images so they correspond to what is in music. It's going to be generally fun, I hope for you too, mostly for me at the beginning. About a few, few other words. I've been composing music for many, many years, as I said, about four decades. I have a decade, one exactly decade of musical education, and I dropped out from college. Why was that? Because in some moment I was really tired. I was a kid. See, you remember, we begin musical education, we usually about six, maybe seven years old. So uh, after a decade, I was 17. And I said to myself, now it's enough uh, of playing someone else's music that... Um, I have the right to change anything except for expression or tempo. And you don't touch a single note in Beethoven because you will be tapped on fingers by a professor. So, of course, nothing was changeable. My professor knew that um, he, he was feeling that, that something is not okay with me, all those da -da 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 for hours, passages for hours playing someone else's music. And he tried to keep me at school and said, well, let's try some jazz. Uh, what he brought to uh, uh, to a classroom, in his understanding of jazz, was uh, was the trivial, was was very basic, and obviously he had no idea what how to teach jazz. So uh, finally, I said, mm, "Okay, enough is enough." I dropped out. Later. I've created a, my fir first jazz group, a trio. We had an extremely talented violinist. We had mm, a little bit less talented bass band and me on piano. Uh, what about my talent? Mm, at the moment, I'd say it was in its beginning of development. Of course, we played a lot. It was all pathetic, but it had some particular feature. It was completely free. I mean, we could do whatever you wanted. It didn't last long. When I began my studies, I created another group. This time it was a quartet. Uh, once again, uh, drums. This time there were drums, bass, uh, a guitar, and me on keyboards. The gentleman with whom I played the, uh, at this time, the guitarist, is my best friend. And after all those decades of passing time, we still record 
uh, music together. Uh, I will present some of those tunes. Uh, some other gentlemen with whom I play, they are coming from different uh, directions of the, uh, of the planet. Now, whatever I do on my own uh, is mostly uh, symphonic music. Be it for movies, be it only just as a purely symphonic music. I do some contemporary music which differs from uh, symphonic in a way that uh, I can use different sounds, I can use noises, I, I do whatever I actually want. A year ago, I began composing, it's not composing, it's just making electronic music. Quite a fun, with knobs and faders and noises and, and effects, quite fine. This will be also presented to you. All this music that I'm talking about is available on most of my, of my uh, streaming platforms and on, on the iTunes or, or Spotify, uh, on my radio, uh, which, about which I'll tell a bit uh, next time we meet. I will try to make it fine. I will try to make it funny. I will try to make it interesting. Also, I'm, I will try to give some hints to younger colleagues who begin composing and writing music on using the libraries of instruments, which is just laboriously sampled instruments, the real instruments, but uh, it's not just as easy as it would look, look like. So there will be some moment when I will be talking about that. As for today, I will end it. The, the, this presentation and next after finishing this video I will invite you to listen to my latest short composition called The First Taste of Freedom. So yeah, have a fun, listen to it. Ciao.